Good. We're over here at the Hall Park Pond. Me, Alex Lozenko, David Scott. I brought a couple rigs. I got some new products I'm gonna be throwing today. Should be an exciting hour or so of fishing. Let's give you guys a peek. Too excited, man. I already made my first cast. Forgot to turn the GoPro on. Yeah, I just record everything and cut out the best pieces. Never know when you might get something cool. Speaking of, I got some new shit in the car. I gotta go grab it. <laughs> Got the new jigs. Oh yeah, this is gonna be exciting. Check it out y'all, I just got some new jigs in. Super stoked man, this is from Filthy Fishing Jigs out of Washington and boy, do they look juicy. I'm about ready to throw these bad boys out, probably with a bandito bug to start because I had luck on a similar jig recently. But check these things out, man. They are hand painted with Protec paint. Woo, they got some nice looking silicone skirts. They're all half ounce. I got like some black and blue variations and some natural variations, a PB&J, a blue speckled. These things look pretty sick. All these go for four bucks and they're made with Gamakatsu hooks, man. I think you guys are gonna like these. I'm about ready to get some action on them. This is gonna be legit. Ho, ho, ho. Half ounce watermelon red flake filthy fishing jig with a watermelon red flake. Bandito bug, fresh out of the box. We're gonna be cruising on the bottom. Remember, I can also swim them. This Bandito bug's got pretty good action on the tail. And I just ordered my heavy rod, which is gonna be perfect for throwing these. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. I just ordered last night the uh, Lunkers TV limited edition defender rod, that green color. Woo super stoked. Stop. Old Davy Jones is stuck over there. <laughs> Me too, baby. We got him, Freed. Right, we we got to catch a fish, though. Let me tie something else on. This is what's gonna get it for us. Where's the pliers? All right. Only got a couple more minutes, y'all. We're gonna throw the uh, sexy shad crankbait. You know she never fails. Here we go, there we go. First one. Oh. There we go, boys. Put us a vlog together, man. Didn't get them on the jig, but they hit the crank. Let's go get the pliers for the little guy. There we go, y'all. First one of the day. Little dink. We're about to go back to the same spot. I think we found where they're hiding. Throw the crank for another minute, then now it's got to split. He's on. Okay. Oh! That's how you don't do it, boys. A couple hooks normally don't let you down. We saw him, we saw him. We saw him, that's right. It's all about the crankbait. I'm holding the rod tip up, that way the crankbait doesn't sink too low. And if you see me pop it, it's because I feel like it's not wiggling like it's supposed to. And so I'm trying to free it of anything it might have picked up on those treble hooks, like a leaf or some grass. A couple crankbait pointers for you guys. Alex, it might be a big one! Hey yo! Oh, he's taking light, he's taking drag! Yes, boys, that's what we were waiting on. There we go. That might be a two and a half. 
Closing in on two and a half, bros. That's how you do it the day before the Super Bowl right there. All right, appreciate y'all watching, man. All the gear's gonna be linked down in the description below. Should be some sick B-roll in this one. Thanks to Alex, man. I'm gonna link all his social media in the description for you guys. He was flying the drone today. Maybe we'll throw some of that footage in. Maybe we won't have it, but, uh, you know, it's been a fun day of fishing, broskies. Glad I got an hour in before work. I'm gonna catch you guys on the next episode. Peace. <laughs> That's two and two. Dude, David's got one across the pond right now. Alex just had to leave, but uh, I'm gonna keep throwing for just a few more minutes. I really wanna get something on this filthy fishing jig, even though I know they're hitting the crankbait. It's okay. They're in this area right here. They're in this pocket. What are you using? He's using a blue worm, it sounds like. Don't wanna let David beat me just cause I wanna catch something on this jig. So let's go ahead and throw the crankbait since we know that's what they're going for today. He's throwing a black and blue worm if I was smart I'd probably just go ahead and tie on the black and blue jig and I'm sure I would get something but let's try this crankbait I think they want it moving the clouds are setting in it's getting a little bit more windy than when I first got here I think this could be the move hey that's him little guy <laughs> oh yeah it's a fun day out here, boys. This is my third, almost fourth. Oh, oh, oh. <sighs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Dun, 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 dun. All right, that was fun for an hour session at the pond we just got kicked out of this last week. But it's a Saturday, so we kind of hit it up after business hours. Not a bad gig, boys. I'm gonna switch y'all over to the big camera for just a second to hit you guys with the outro. The quick recap, David, how many did you get? Three. Mug. Almost four. Almost four. Me as well, man, same thing. Did yours come off? They came off like a foot from the shore. Yeah. Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we might try and film a little bit more tomorrow, it sounds like, for yeah. the Super Bowl. Are you well, down for that? So now that you're going to work, I'm gonna go to the Legacy Pond and fish. <sighs> man, he's got more time. Send me the pictures of what you catch. It's starting to rain now, so perfect time to get finished up over here, you guys. Might just hit a half shell. He might just get food instead. <laughs> well, you guys know I'm linking the gear down in the description. Everything I like to use, my favorites. And uh, we'll catch you guys on the next vlog, man. Had a ton of fun today. Till the next one. Peace.